Welcome to Slowpoke Travel. Uh, in today's episode, we are going to review the artistic aesthetic of an Airbnb. I'm doing this not to review the Airbnb itself, but this is a new series where we will look at how an Airbnb is accented, and then we will rate it on a scale of 1 to 10. Uh, we'll begin here at the vent, and this is also where we will finish up. So as you see, this is a lovely vent with a box of baking soda in it which uh, I think gives it a, a little more character than a vent without a box of baking soda in it. This, I'm sure there's some student right now wringing his hands, wondering where his lovely serene mountain sheet has gotten to. Window unit AC, a classic, 10 out of 10, big thumbs up. Radiant heat, the worst kind of heat. Not a fan of these radiators. Luckily, it's non-functioning. All radiant heat should be non-functioning. In the winter time, you can back up into these and have to go to the hospital. This art speaks for itself. I mean, really, I like the way this room is laid out. It's highly functional. We've kind of trashed it up a little bit. But we're messy people when we're on the road. Thrift shop chic, I guess you would call this. We've got some map art on the wall. And it pairs well with the globe here in the living room. A classic old globe, a nice yellowed ancient globe that's secured. It's actually a part of the tabletop. So we really can't even see the southern hemisphere. But the Air, Airbnb has a semi-spotty a Wi-Fi, so this will come in handy. <laughs> you know, if if our Google, if we can't access Google Maps, you know, we can always uh, see if we can find a route here. Now, I really like this room. In fact, I like this entire Airbnb because it is old. It is ancient. I think this building. How old do you think this building is? Most of the, the buildings 20s. in this area, yeah, from the 1920s. A lot of cool features. But I this think. doesn't belong. This TV doesn't belong. Oh, they're trying to give you things that you want. Yeah, but we got radiant heat. We got defunct fireplace. Oh. You know, and then they've got this mm, questionable theater seating and a giant TV. It doesn't match well with the uh, the little tin airplane. I like how this art is kind of like oh. It's a music box? I don't even... Okay. <laughs> I've... <laughs> okay, we've uh, discovered something new. I don't know how to turn it off though now. So the plane is a music box. I don't know what this is. But all this stuff is interactive art. And of course a Bahama sailboat. But I don't know, what would you rate this? I I'd say this is 8 out of 10. I think there's a lot of cool... I love the books and magazines. There's a variety. Oh, yeah. Camera Girl's loving the knick-knack shelf. We got a Rubik's Cube. It's not... Uh, we got Cards Against Humanity. We got a nice assortment of books. This here's another boat. Except this is, is made with poker chips. I think that's clever. That, isn't that yeah. supposed to be Viking? It's something to think about, certainly. Yeah. I can't tell. This is a Banksy, right? What's that? A Banksy? I can't tell if it's an original. I don't know art. I just know what I like. Who said that? I like this one here because it's kind of got some neutral tones and then the flower has a little bit of color to it. So I think that's some kind of statement. Let's take a look outside. It is still raining. So this is a lovely little town, but the rain is keeping us inside. Here in the center of the door, we've got something else here. I don't want to touch it because it might be another music box. Oh, there's another thing that I don't want to touch. I'll show you this here. Because a lot of times with Airbnbs, I mean, it's a, it's a new environment, so there are all kinds of mysteries to discover. But this one here, I didn't even have to discover. 
it's just a little box next to the table with a little sign that says don't touch and I think they put that on there because they want you to touch it I think if I touch it something will happen I think that lid will open up and something will pop out you know there's probably candy bars in there or something but I don't know because of my deeply ingrained conditioning as a as a child it says don't touch so I even though I want to touch it I can't touch it I've just been a good boy and there's nothing I can do about it all right let's get back on track we've covered everything in here um, this art very educational you can learn all about fish and birds and butterflies this is actually not more art this is just my wet britches hanging up and now we come over here to the what's the David Bowie song about the guy in space that's what makes me think of this here although he's got a jellyfish I don't know what this is but this is definitely more college art now this here the piece de resistance gras uh, giant kitchen and they kind of accented it uh, with beer bottles old alcoholic detritus which is usually not a good call when you're decorating anything except the college dorm room you know certainly not an Airbnb usually this is not a good move but it works for this here I don't mind it at all and in fact they paired it with an actual painting of wine and alcohol bottles it works and then we've got um i don't know what this here is this is uh this really doesn't go with the uh with the bottles this looks like a gainsborough again could be original this is a paddle when i think see a paddle with holes in it i think of like a, a paddle for beating children or students now this airbnb um it's not dirty it's not exactly clean it's just old but it has a lot of character and I would rather have old and character than new and clean I don't know as long as it's not expensive because I expect to a uh, deal uh, and we got one here so I'm happy about that this is my favorite piece of art in the whole place a 10 out of 10 look at that Tyrannosaurus Rex trying desperately to make a French press cup of coffee. There is no Banksy that can measure up to that. That's my level of art right here. Here's another one. Boom. Let's see. I can't figure out the lighting in here. Oops, can't do that because there's a vent. But that's the dinky little bathroom. No art. There's a piece of art in progress, but we won't focus on that. I guess there is no light in here. So we'll just have to study this one here in the, the dim dimness. I guess this is Moby Dick. And I and I gotta give this a 10 out of 10. I really like this. And this is the vent where we started. The baking soda is on the other side. This is the back of that vent. So really interesting. I really like this place. But there we have it. This is our current Airbnb. As we travel between house sits, spending way too much money on the road, drinking way too much coffee, eating way too many pastries, introducing ourselves to new sites, and new ideas so I would rate this Airbnb a solid 10 out of 10 what about you camera girl what what are the criteria it's just a number that you pull out of your butt seven a seven there you have it ten for me seven from camera girl so out of a possible 20 we've got 17 until next time we'll see you on the road